Hello, this is <clears throat> Lady in White. So I have a little cough. Um, the city or country of this work is Vienna, Austria, and it is at the Belvedere. The artist responsible for this work is Gustav Klimt. He is, um, I saw both Austrian and Hungarian when I was looking up um, his nationality. So I just put Austria, austro hung Hungarian. <clears throat> um, the medium of the work is oil on canvas. It's post impressionism. Um, the historical relevance of this work is that the work was left unfinished when he unexpectedly unexpectedly suffered from a stroke and died. Um, how long it took to create is unknown. Why is it important? It's because it's a good example of his approach. Um, in his in the late periods of his life, um, and it's likely an idealized um, female portrait. Some defining characteristics of this portrait is that um, it's a square canvas and it forms kind of like a diagonal right here, I'm dividing up the picture, and in the center is the figure of the woman, um, the left side is a lighter background and then the right side is a darker background. The historical contributions is that he is Vienna's one of Vienna's most renowned artists of the era. <clears throat> My personal observation of this painting is that she kind of looks like she has clown makeup on. Um, she has a big smile and looks like she's posing for a picture. Um, I chose this work because it really stood out in the room and also there's a replica of this painting on the ceiling which I'll show right now okay here's the replica that was on the ceiling um yeah and so that's why I chose the work um how does it compare to other works from this period it's very elaborate even though it's unfinished it is very elaborate um it shows that it shows like an idealized woman very attractive the brushwork is very quick and short and a fun fact is that Klimt also painted the famous work, The Kiss.